Hello YouTube, this is Nof20. Uh, I was actually just watching my latest video, Fat Kid Laughs Like an Idiot, uh, and I actually started to cry again because it was that funny. Every time I watch this video now, I, I lose my... Lose it. I don't want to say shit. I just did. I lose my shit. Um, <clears throat> let's walk, shall we? Got a few things to talk about. Hey Jer, Jer's here. Just got him on camera a little bit, he's going to be pissed about it though. Um, <clears throat> so, as I've repeatedly uh, repeated myself uh, on numerous occasions with all of my videos, I plan on getting better equipment so I can stop making these ridiculous iPhone videos every time we talk. Ugh, I'm going to take a seat now. Um, okay. uh, I don't know if I mentioned before, too, recent, within the past month, I went and sold a bunch of uh, items on eBay including a guitar, uh, two amplifiers, my Canon XL1S because it's basically broken, uh, and a video game. Everything seemed to be going smoothly, but I didn't charge enough for shipping because I'm an idiot and I didn't look into it enough, so that was my fault. Okay, cool. Um, long story short, I had to refund the two uh, amplifiers, the money for it, because where I'm at, it just it's ridiculously expensive and I just did not charge nowhere near enough, so... I refunded them both in full. Um, right here, I have the Canon XL1S all boxed up, ready to go. Um, I'm actually going to ship this out Friday uh, for the gentleman who decided to purchase it, who is very awesome. Uh, but yeah, everything's packed up in there. I wrapped it all in bubble wrap for him. Uh, I put the manual in there. I, I found actually a few more things from the camera that I didn't mention in the sale, so I think he's going to be very happy. Now, while we're on topic uh, of cameras... I, I, um, I'm, I'm completely changing my whole thing here because I've only shot with uh, handy cams, regular camcorders, everything like that when I make videos or you know a cell phone. I've never actually used uh, an SLR or a DSLR camera. I'm a complete noob. When I got this Canon XL1S, XL1S, yeah, I said that right. Um, that was my first actual time being able to use a lens and have the manual focus, the manual zoom, everything. It was um, it was fun though. It was really awesome. Manual focus is really really awesome to have. I do love it. Uh, but yeah, I've never actually used a SLR camera, so um, I'm I figured after researching enough and you know using common sense, DSLR cameras and SLR cameras are the way to go, and they have way better you know cam like a. Uh, Video footage, just shooting videos on an SLR is amazing compared to a camcorder. It's not even worth it anymore. Like, you, you think camera, you gotta get a camcorder. No. These are the way to go. So I've been tossing up between um, Canon 7D, which, as you know, is the top dog uh, for pretty much uh, Canon cameras right now, uh, as far as I know. Um, one, I mean, one of the biggest reasons, too, is they're very expensive. Um, the quality, though, is out of this world uh, with the Canon 7D. You can shoot somebody taking a shit or just puking or, I don't know, eating Chinese food, and it's going to look amazing in a 7D without, um, with little to no editing. Um, it's going to look really good. Um, but yeah, the Canon 7D, and I'm sticking with Canon. I, I prefer Canon. Nikon is pretty good, but I really don't want to touch base with them right now. Maybe some down the road, but I'm sticking with Canon because they've been good to me. Uh, the Canon XL1S, as poor as the, uh, you know, as I was to it actually, and it broke, it wasn't actually the camera's fault. The quality was pretty decent for an XL1, but it's, um, you know, it's not a, it's not a digital camera. It's, uh, I can't even, <laughs> I can't even think. It's a, um, it's an older camera. That uses AV cables and stuff. It's uh, standard definition. It's not, you know, high. So it's it's kind of hard. It feels like you're watching an episode of Degrassi from the 90s when you shoot with it. Which I didn't mind. I thought it was kind of funny. Anyway, uh, I'm sticking with Canon. And I've been tossing in between the Canon 7D or the Canon 550D, a.k.a. the T2i Rebel. And both cameras look amazing. Like, obviously the 7 is going to be the firm choice for quality. Um, the 550D, however, is really, really good in the pocket, or the wallet, I guess you could say. Uh, very, very, uh, good that way. 
it's much much cheaper because usually the Canon 7D runs around 16 or 1700 I think is probably the cheapest you can buy it um, and that's with a stock lens and the body itself or the nothing else and from what I've seen the 550D I think you can get for maybe like eight or nine hundred maybe even cheaper and that's also uh, with the body and uh, the stock lens so <clears throat> what I'm here to ask is give me uh, your pros and cons on each camera for someone who is just jumping into SLR cameras uh, or DSL DSLR cameras I'm sorry um, but it's kind of it's pretty much a noob to those kind of cameras what do you think would be the best bet but I don't want something that's gonna have crap quality I want amazing quality as well so that's why I'm really thinking of just jumping right into the 7D because if you're shooting a camera and it's got amazing quality people are gonna pay attention and then you can go from there like if the least the quality is gonna bring your audience in then you can you know focus on actual ideas for videos and structuring each one and breaking it down so what do you think is a good uh, recommendation uh, between the 7D, 550D, any other Canon or any other um, DSLR, DSLR, <laughs> DSLR camera? If there's Nikon involved, just throw it out there. That's fine. But Nikon and Canon are basically the two companies I like to stick with. So let me know in the comments below. Message me anything. Um, let me know what you guys think. Those are my top choices, but if you can think of another one, Please don't hesitate to throw by me. Um, actually, also, I want to, for editing, because I need to get new editing software as well. I was using Sony Vegas 8.0, uh, which was pretty good. Uh, I didn't know anything about video editing. I learned a lot through YouTube, and I did everything with Sony Vegas, and I was able to do a lot. I mean, let's just say if you're a guy that used to use Movie Maker, and then you jumped to Sony Vegas, it's basically like using a phone camera that jumped into Spielberg. You know, that was the difference. Like, it was awesome. Um, but I was thinking about getting the Adobe Premiere package with Photoshop, uh, Adobe Premiere, Adobe After Effects, um, everything like that. So let me know if that's a good software, if you think of another software. Um, nothing with Mac. I don't have a Mac. You know, I have, win I have a Windows computer. Uh, I'm getting an HP Tower. So please stick with that. Um, audio equipment, let me know. I don't know the names of some of the equipment I was looking at, but I did see some audio recorders. Um, road mics usually are what I would look for for a shotgun mic. My one buddy uh, has a road mic on his, and it's very, very nice. Uh, road is pretty much the way to go. And um, I'm also getting some basic lighting equipment as well. But let me know, uh, filmmakers and you know video YouTubers alike, let me know what you guys use. What is a good example? What is a good recommendation, suggestion for someone who's a noob? Uh, and yeah, just let me know. Thanks.